Welcome to the Organic Balcony Garden. Today is October 12th, 2011. Okay, so here's the beets. Uh, they're still going. Uh, not getting any bigger, but we're still getting the leaves. Uh, and the sturgeon uh, has another flower. A couple flowers there, as you can see. Okay, here we have the carrots. And as you can see here, let me zoom in. Got some of the carrots you know, popping out. Um, the, beet, the pepper plant is still growing, but we're getting a lot of um, leaves getting eaten, eaten by the, the bugs. Here we have some uh, little tomato plants coming along. We have a new addition, which I'm really happy to present. We have the melon plant. So as you can see, it's getting bigger. It has these little tentacles trying to hang on and uh, hopefully grow up this uh, lattice. So see how that goes. The uh, second planting of radishes, they got ravished and uh, pretty much all eaten up by the worms, the bugs, uh, whatever, cabbage worms. Uh, hot pepper plant never made those peppers. They did flower, had a couple flowers. Guinea fruit. Um, here we have the Swiss chard, still doing pretty well. Uh, along with these other tomatoes. Does anyone know this? They're getting all this white powdery stuff. It does come off, but um, now the Swiss chard is getting it as well. If I wash it off, is it okay to eat? That's my question. Um, this one has some flowers. They've been having flowers for quite a while, but uh, no fruit yet. Here we have the original carrots growing uh, with the chives. So the chives are still there, garlic chives. Uh, hopefully those will continue to grow. The biggest tomato plant, that one's still alive. There's uh, no fruit on it right now. It's been getting ravished by these little worms. Um, but uh, the tops are growing. Um, been trying to keep the worms off. And uh, this top part looks actually pretty good. I've got this little setup with the bamboo here. Um, to help support it now that it's about five feet tall so yeah thank you for joining us and um, see you next time with an update again really happy about the melon growing really well so that's it from here